Hey, travel friends. Today on Doodle the Travel Bug, we're giving you our top three tips for visiting the Guinness Storehouse. The Guinness Storehouse is located in the heart of downtown Dublin, and we highly recommend making the pilgrimage here for a pint. So here's our top tips. Number C. First on the list, be prepared for an enjoyable but a very Disney-esque experience. This is not a brewery or factory tour. The storehouse is seven floors of sensory immersion, kind of like a Willy Wonka's but for beer. The journey of Guinness brewing process starts with barley, water from the Wicklow Mountains, and hops. All simple elements but mixed together into a magical potion. We could feel our skin toasting in the roasting room as our Guinness story continued. The first tasting room feels like a dream, all white with aroma fog. Baby cheers! Baby cheers. Number two! Next, Guinness Storehouse is family friendly, so bring the kiddos along. The tour is self guided, so you can do it at any speed, even six year old ludicrous speed. The kids love the floor dedicated to art and advertising. It shows how the art has evolved with creative displays. And here's a bit of history on an iconic piece. The harp is the um, logo for Guinness, and they picked it way long time ago. It's a famous harp. But then when the uh, Irish government needed one also in the mid-1900s, they picked the harp also, that same harp, but they had to do a mirror image of it so as not to have um, patent infringement kind oh, of stuff cool. on the Guinness factory. But now they look like they're the same, even though they're technically the mirror image of each other. At the end, all guests are rewarded at the Gravity Bar. It's a 360 degree view of Dublin, and it is stunning, especially with a pint of creamy Guinness in your hand. Or, if you're under 21, a couple of sodas. The kids love spotting famous Dublin landmarks and having a bird's eye view of the city. Number one! And our number one tip, when you're trying to piece together your Ireland trip, we suggest making the storehouse first or last because the Guinness storehouse will store your luggage. So if you arrive in Dublin and say your Airbnb is not quite ready, you're covered. Or if your Emerald Isle trip is coming to an end and you're leaving midday, you can still squeeze in one last adventure while having all your luggage and being close to the airport. Just remember to get your tickets in advance so you get the time slot you want. Uh, I can't think of a better way to finish a trip to Ireland than with our pint of Guinness. We, uh, we learned that, what did we learn, Stace? We could the, never relax while driving. Yep, yeah, they're, they're, they're road, their backcountry roads are more like goat paths that are half a car wide that you have to share with box trucks. And uh, it's, it's, get the insurance for your car, I guess is the lesson there. And then uh, it's easily, it really is one of the most friendliest countries. It's yeah, everybody's lots been of so friendly people. nice, so friendly and so fun and so welcoming. And I think there's some guys' jobs that are, they, they just, in the country, that they, their job is just to stand on the corner and smile at you. I mean, that, that's all they do. And it's fantastic. Uh, so, cheers, cheers to, to Ireland. Ireland. For more unique travel shows, like and subscribe to see where Doodlebug goes next.